Welcome back to the Ultimate Human Podcast, where we uncover the hidden intricacies of health issues that often remain in the shadows. I'm your host, Gary Brecka, and today we're setting our sights on a condition that is far more common than many might think sleep apnea. This episode promises to be a comprehensive explanation of sleep apnea, diving into its complex science, understanding the multifaceted risks that it poses, and shedding light on the innovative treatments that are changing the landscape of this disorder. So buckle up as we embark on this deep dive into the hidden world of sleep apnea, its impact on health, and the pioneering solutions that are at the forefront of medical science. Globally, sleep apnea is a condition that affects an estimated 1 billion individuals, sort of illustrating its extensive reach and the significant impact it has on public health. But what exactly is sleep apnea? The disorder is characterized by repeated interruptions in breathing during sleep, a condition that can severely disrupt sleep quality and overall health. Most commonly, this takes the form of obstructive sleep apnea, where the throat muscles fall intermittently to the back of the throat, collapsing and blocking the airway. truly grasp the scope of sleep apnea, you have to understand its pathophysiology. Obstructive sleep apnea involves a sequence of events where the closure of the airway leads to decreased blood oxygen levels and results in brief periods of awakening known as arousal periods. These disruptions which occur in hundreds of times each night often go unnoticed by the person suffering from sleep apnea, yet they significantly impair that person's body's restorative sleep process. The implications of untreated sleep apnea are wide-ranging and severe. Numerous health complications, including hypertension, cardiovascular disease, diabetes, stroke, and even depression. Pioneering studies such as those published in the Journal of Clinical Sleep Medicine and The Lancet highlight the direct correlations between severe untreated sleep apnea and an increased risk of hypertension, atrial fibrillation, heart attacks, and even premature death. In the mortality space, when we studied this, we, we had a model called the hypoxic model, which was how well the body was utilizing oxygen oxygen, and sleep apnea deprives the body of of needed oxygen uh, during the nighttime. And of course, you wake up in a suffocated state, which is often why people that suffer from sleep apnea wake up with morning headaches or they wake up very, very groggy. It takes them 45 minutes or an hour to even get their motor going. The strain that disrupted breathing places on the body night after night can lead to chronic cardiovascular stress, systemic inflammation, and even metabolic dysregulation. This underscores the critical need for effective management and treatment. As our understanding of this condition has evolved, so too have the strategies for diagnosis and treatment. Originally, it was perceived as more of an annoyance. Uh, Sleep apnea is now recognized as a critical risk factor for many cardiovascular and chronic diseases, shifting the medical community's approach towards the more sophisticated diagnostic and therapeutic techniques. In the realm of diagnostics, advancements in technology have introduced tools that utilize artificial intelligence and machine learning to analyze sleep patterns with unprecedented accuracy and non invasiveness. These tools can detect subtle abnormalities in breathing and sleep architecture that human observers might miss, allowing for earlier detection and intervention. On the treatment front, options have expanded far beyond the traditional CPAP. CPAP stands for this continuous positive airway pressure machine, and innovations in treatment include adjustable airway pressure devices that adapt the user's specific needs throughout the night, implantable devices that stimulate throat muscles to prevent airway collapse, and various surgical options that can actually structure alter and stabilize the airway. Additionally, the development of postural therapy devices and custom-fitted oral appliances offer alternatives for patients seeking non-CPAP solutions. Yet treatment of sleep apnea extends beyond medical devices and surgeries. Lifestyle interventions play a crucial role in managing and mitigating the effects of sleep apnea. Simple but effective lifestyle changes have a profound impact on the symptoms and the overall health outcomes. These include optimizing sleep positions to alleviate airway obstruction, improving diet to reduce pro-inflammatory foods, maintaining a healthy weight, and engaging in regular physical activity. Yes, exercise can help sleep apnea. Such interventions do not only enhance sleep quality, but also contribute to overall metabolic health and well-being. 
Looking to the future, the field of sleep apnea research is vibrant with exploration into genetic predispositions and the potential for personalized medicine. Ongoing studies aim to uncover the genetic markers that are associated with sleep apnea, which could also lead to more customized and effective treatment plans. This personalized approach promises to tailor therapies to individual genetic profiles, potentially improving treatment efficacy and patient outcomes significantly. As we conclude today's examination of sleep apnea on the Ultimate Human podcast, it's essential to recognize the importance of this condition's proactive management. Whether it affects you personally or someone close to you, staying informed about the latest advancements in research and treatment options is crucial. Knowledge is not just power, it's a pathway to transformation. Thank you for tuning in to today's episode. If you found this discussion informative, please subscribe and join us again as we continue to explore and demystify the complex world of health. Together, we can tackle these covert threats to our well-being and march towards a healthier, more enlightened future. Remember, every piece of information holds the key to unlocking our ultimate potential. And that, folks, is just science.